endangered animals in the Philippines. Philippine Crocodiles Sierra Madre del Norte, Northern Sierra Madre, the Philippine crocodile is commonly regarded as a dangerous livestock and man-eating predator. In actuality, the snails that assist farmers control introduced pest species in their rice fields are what they devour, especially the critically endangered Philippine crocodile. This is an uncommon animal in the Philippines and the rest of the world. The critically endangered Philippine crocodile is smaller than other crocodiles, measuring roughly 5 feet long and weighing just over 30 pounds. 2. Philippine Eagle Leyte, Luzon, Mindanao, and Samar are all places where you can find them. The Philippine Eagle is a one-of-a-kind bird. The critically endangered Philippine eagle makes a majestic impression with its creamy white underbelly and crown-like shaggy feathers. However, because its population is categorized as severely endangered, this one-of-a-kind eagle is now in jeopardy. It is now one of the country's top 10 endangered species. In the wild, only 400 adult Philippine eagle endangered pairs survive. The Philippine Eagle Foundation has previously rescued approximately 80 eagles since the 1970s, when the Philippine Eagle Conservation status was established. 3. Tamarau Mindoro was discovered. The Tamarau, an endemic species in the Philippines, is another highly endangered animal that may soon become extinct. Only the province of Mindoro is home to the critically endangered Tamarau. It has lustrous black hair, backward-facing horns, and is no taller than a kindergartner, but it is known for its fury and will readily use its horns against intruders, a habit known as tusking. 4. Bombon Sardine, Tawilis Tall Lake was discovered. The Bombon Sardine, also known as the Tawilis, is one of the Philippines' uncommon animals, and it is currently one of the country's top 10 endangered species. Tawilis is the world's only freshwater sardine species, found solely in Tall Lake. Its population has plummeted because to overfishing, illegal fishing, the expansion of fish cages, and declining water quality. 5. Calamian and Philippine Spotted Deer Calamian deer, found on the Palawan Islands of Buswanga, Kalaat, Kulyan, Merrily, and Damakiat. The Philippine spotted deer can be found on the islands of western Visayas. Calamian and Philippine spotted deers are two of the Philippines' top ten endangered species. Hunting, human settlement, and agricultural growth in the Calamian deer's habitats are all contributing to the population decline. Because of a limited distribution, habitat alteration due to agriculture and forestry, and poaching, the Philippine spotted deer is in decline. 6. Tarsier Bohol is the location of this discovery. Many individuals searched for tarsiers before the establishment of the Philippine Tarsier and Wildlife Sanctuary. The world's second smallest primates were being sold, maintained as pets by private individuals in circumstances unsuitable for their survival, or killed. Because of this, Former Philippine President Fidel V. Ramos issued Proclamation No. 1030 on June 23, 1997, designating tarsiers as a specially protected faunal species in the Philippines. As a result, the Philippines Tarsier Sanctuary was established for their preservation. 7. Sea Turtles The Philippines is home to five of the seven sea turtle species. All of them are endangered and belong to the Philippines' endangered species list. Overexploitation of eggs and adult females on nesting beaches, as well as juveniles and males in foraging areas. And degradation of marine ecosystems are the main causes of the green turtle's population reduction. In the case of the leatherback turtle, incidental catch in fisheries has the greatest impact on its population followed by human consumption and coastal development. Coastal development, pollution, and climate change are all factors that affect the loggerhead. 8. Balabak Mouse Deer, Pilindok, in Palawan, 
they can be found in the islands of Balabak, Bugsuk, Ramos, Apulet, and Kalat. The Balabak mouse deer, commonly known as Pilandok, is another threatened species in the Philippines. This unique species can only be found in Palawan, in the towns of Balabak, Bugsuk, Ramos, Apulet, and Kalat. Pilandoks are poached for food, evicted from their habitat due to agricultural conversion and occasionally subjected to live animal trade. The Pilandok may soon join the ranks of extinct creatures in the Philippines if we do not protect it sufficiently. 9. Wild Pig, Baboy Damo, the four wild pig species above, known locally as Baboy Damo, are native to the Philippines and are classed as near-threatened vulnerable, and critically endangered in the Philippines. The reason for this is that wild pigs are hunted for food in the area. Let us all do our share to help safeguard the Philippines' wild creatures. 10. Philippine Forest Turtle The Philippine Forest Turtle is one of the Philippines' most critically endangered species, and one of the world's top 25 most endangered turtle species. According to the Turtle Conservancy, the real geographic distribution of the turtle in the Philippines was unknown for nearly 80 years until a chance discovery of one specimen in a Palawan market in the late 1980s, and then the rediscovery of wild populations in 2004. This rediscovery, however, had a negative impact because many people searched for the Philippine forest turtle for illicit wildlife trade for pets and food which is why it is one of the Philippines' most endangered species.